Oh no. Where the fuck am I? Like, I don't know what to do, man. Like, ugh. this is getting so fucking annoying. Ugh. I'm not going that way anymore. Fuck that. Like, I can't take a vehicle, I CAN'T WALK! Oh, of course. Oh, fucking course. I can't walk, I can't take a vehicle. What am I supposed to do? I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Like, I'm not. I don't know, man. I don't know what else to say. I'm getting so fucking annoyed. They're everywhere. Just let me fucking go! This is getting really annoying for me right now. What 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 do you, what do you want from me? What do you want from me? I don't know what else to do. That's it. I can't do this. I, I just, I don't know what else to do. Driving isn't an option. Walking isn't an option. Like, what the fuck? Sorry, I'm getting really irritated. Holy shit. This has not been the best week for me. I'll tell you that right now. I thought that I could just sit back, relax, and chill with a nice, nice, calming stream and game, but 
This is even getting a little fucking irritating for me. Man, this is Im this is fucking impossible. I don't know, maybe if I go this way, avoid them all together. Turn, please! God, I'm soon gonna fucking throw my goddamn fucking monitor all across the fucking room. I don't think I've ever actually been this pissed off on stream. And if I have, it's been quite some time. I don't know, I've just, I've just been so fucking irritated this week. Everything's getting me fucking just people, morons, fucking idiots in this fucking world today. There we go. I just, I don't know, man. Like, is this even the best route? I don't fucking know. I got this to look forward to. It would be nice to drive, but it seems like walking is the most effective if you're not being fucking fucked by these fucking BTs. Repairing cargo, oh my god. I'm honestly soon just gonna give up, because I can't I can't do this. Let me do my fucking thing. Come on. Like, I, I'm actually getting really irritated. Because I don't know what else to do. Driving is an option. Walking is clearly just worse. Like, containers are being... Are you, containers are damaged. I don't, I don't know what else to do. Like, I, I want to get there quicker. But safe, for, but safe. Let's all give Sam a hand. He's a real trooper, one of a kind. Still fucking too. Oh my god. Oh, I don't know what else to do. It would be, it would be so fucking nice if there was just a much easier way to get rid of this shit. I would love to get rid of the bomb first, but that's farther. And you gotta go through fucking BT Terra. Here, here goes my fucking cock sucking fucking shit. <clears throat> Can I save? So I don't have to fucking start all the way back there again if I fail again.
There's that. But why can't this be the fucking bomb area? Container damage. Container damage. Container damage. You know what? Fucking suck my cock. Yeah, yeah. This has been the, this, I don't know, ladies and gents, I do apologize, I'm trying not to get so irritated, but holy fuck, just this week has taken a fucking toll on me. Like, it sucks because there's times, there's times throughout the week that I was hoping that there would be relaxation times or whatever. Nah, those relaxation times turn into fucking annoyance times. Okay, that's that's not what I wanted to do, but that it's good to know, you know. Yeah. Sam Bridges. Oh, thank God for that. I, I was worried you might not get here in time, but then I've done nothing but worry of late. I've been haunted by those visions you doom sufferers see. That end of day stuff. I put the nightmares down to fatigue. The uh, possibility of chiral contamination never even occurred to me. Uh, it's just lucky we caught it before the suicidal stage. Dying's not an option. My research is nowhere near complete. It's not just my life you're saving here. It's my life's work. I started to wonder if I'd ever see these meds. I guess you really are good at what you do, huh? Thank you. Just like that, I'm part of the UCA, with access to a treasure trove of historical research materials. Studying this fossil beach should be a good deal easier now. Assuming I can prove once for all that that's what it is. Honestly, though, I'm just excited I can finally share these findings with everyone. Can you believe I found chiral deposits in strata dating back 65 and a half million years? Evidence of an ancient death stranding. Chiral matter has existed on Earth since long before the dawn of man. This stratum is proof of that. Look at this, Sam. Do you see that black fissure there? We believe this is the source of the Chirelian readings. In the distant past, earthquakes caused frictional melting along fault lines, producing layers of what is known as pseudotachylite. We call these layers fossil earthquakes. Extending the principle, our fissure here is what one might term a fossil beach. The presence of corellium in this of all strata cannot be a mere coincidence. It strongly suggests that beaches must have appeared during the Cretaceous Paleogene extinction event. And not just then. The chiral network has recovered data suggesting that similar fossil beaches were discovered in strata corresponding to other extinction events too. That would seem to indicate the Big Five and all other major extinctions were accompanied by the appearance of beaches. In expanding the chiral network, you've helped us glimpse a pattern in these scattered points of data. 
you furthered our individual research projects and ensured that it is only a matter of time before we recover all we have lost and solve every mystery that remains. But this is only the beginning. See this through, Sam, and there's no telling what we might learn. Good work. New order available. Please access delivery... That even no, I don't think that would be better. Let's get rid of this fucking bomb. Hold on. My uh, cargo is better now, my weight or whatever. Weapons restrictions lifted. I should have probably. Hold on. Before, before I leave, I'm gonna grab a scan. container of spray, fucking design. bitch shit, whatever the hell it's called. Yeah, I need to. Verifying ID. Clear. I need it. All weapons will remain locked until departure. All clear. Welcome, Sam Porter Bridges. Is, is it even here? Is it even here? There's no repair spray? Wait, what? Oh, there it is. Fucking look right at it. I don't know how many it takes to... I don't know how many it takes to, like, get it up to a decent percentage, but... How do I use it, I wonder? Repair. Now let's see if this works. Okay, yeah. Fully restored. Nice. Oh, 50%. There we go, that's not bad. It's actually much better. Now we actually have... Now we actually have, um... What's the word? What am I, what am I trying to look for here? Now it's actually, you know... Thank you, for your you know what? I don't even remember what I was going to try to say, so I'm not even going to worry about it. At least I've got less cargo on me now, so my weight or whatever do a lot better stamina.
Okay, so now before we go any further, I'm saving. Because fuck that. Not doing this shit again. Probably a really bad idea to be sliding down that. Yeah, it's probably a really bad idea to slide down that, honestly. Hello, can you turn left? What are you doing? Why are you not turning left? that it's just down here so there is a way you can avoid the fucking BTs altogether good cuz fuck them again you know just in case those BTs can fucking suck my fucking hairy cock Scan. Scanning 
Bridges ID. Fragile Express ID verified. All weapons will remain locked until departure. Cargo verified. Thank you. To be honest, ladies and gentlemen, I never thought I'd actually fucking be able to make it. I never thought I'd actually be able to do it, to be honest. I thought That's I was gonna have to like friend. give up for the night. Thanks to you we can find do it some other night. Dig. I swear, this place Let's is see what happens when you don't give up. <laughs> yeah, see what happens when you don't give up, I guess. Not that I need to tell you. <laughs> you did it after all. To be honest, I should have honestly after just life, gone imagine. the route I just went after I died, what was it, like the second or third time? I should have just gone my original route, which is, um, obviously the route I just went is what I'm referring to, and that was the safer route. Didn't in didn't encounter a single motherfucking BT. So that's good. You can set up the chiral network while I work. Oxygen mask, that's cool. Nice little two. Anyway, as it turns out, Sam Bridges, I have a favor to ask. A local porter was on his way here with something very valuable, but dropped it en route. It's a 200 million year old ammonite, which looks, he says, almost as if it were still alive. He apparently stumbled across it in a boulder field, which had previously been hidden beneath a glacier, but that's not the half of it. The man claims this ammonite has an umbilical cord. <sighs> an umbilical cord. Color me skeptical, but a specimen merits study, and I wasn't about to leave such delicate work to an amateur. So I asked him to carve out the whole surrounding chunk of rock and bring it here to me. Naturally, I wanted to compare it with contemporary specimens in the vicinity. Which is why I had him excavate a number of those in addition to the one he told me about. But what does a dumb fuck go and do? He loses the whole shipment. Didn't even have the good sense to mark which container had the ammonite with the umbilical cord. The cargo was supposedly lost in the area to the southwest, where toxic gases have a tendency to build up. Old Mr. Reliable claims his cargo scanner is broken, and there's no way he can recover the shipment. But you... You could track it down. To protect you against the fumes, I'll provide you with an oxygen mask. Just to be safe. You can pick it up when you accept the order. That fossil could represent an epical discovery. While there are examples of viviparous fish, an ammonite with an umbilical cord is unheard of. And if it is indeed 200 million years old, it would also correspond with the end Triassic extinction. Another one of the big five. Could the umbilical cord be connected to the beach? We must recover that cargo at all costs. It could provide a vital clue to the mechanisms underpinning the Death Stranding. We're so close. So very, very close to grasping the true nature of the phenomenon. Hurry, Sam. We cannot risk that ammonite being lost. Mm -hmm. 